Yes. Okay. Well, it's really nice to have you here, Chris. And uh, and I know we 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 you came here early, and we um, we did the we did the music pre tape the musical performances. So we're really looking forward to that. And and I'm just curious. So you're from Saint Lucia? Yes. Uh, which is uh, great. I've met uh, quite a few people from Saint Lucia here in Toronto. And uh, so you've been here about 20 years. I'm just curious, um, what what was it, like what made you come to Toronto or, or what was, or when did you, you know, like what's the story of how you came? Were you, what, what were you walking down the, the street or down the beach one day and said, well, I just want to, I'm thinking about Toronto. I don't know. What was it? I, I, I was thinking of going so many different places from the island because when you build a foundation, in your community where you come from you want to take that foundation to a different province a different country mm -hmm. and uh mix with a different environment mm -hmm. so that you could see whether if your talent could be uh prosper or go further when you go out there and people that you could meet a new people and uh see new things meet right. new mm -hmm. artists uh work with new people yeah. in the entertainment industry. It seems to me like just my own experience, because I'm not from Toronto either, right? I'm from somewhere in Ontario, but a smaller town. And it just seems to me that Toronto is really a place where people come to work, to do their life's work. Because it's a, you know, there's a lot of business and stuff in the city. And, and it sounds like you did, that's why you came here, to take your talent and just bring it to the world. and and to work on it as as we were talking earlier uh you know uh, uh, even being an artist is a business right yes to, to, to make it uh, as it a is. professional uh life's work yes uh basically yes that is everything you say that's what i try to do but sometimes you 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 get a little drawback in everything that you try to do mm -hmm. out of your circle. Uh, meeting new faces and being with new people, it's a challenge. It's a challenge to get what you really want and what's your goal at. So you have to work hard on whatever that you are looking out there to get. You got to work hard on that and let uh, other artists like you who lives in the Caribbean to know that they could do the same thing also. And being here in Toronto, it's real diversity. It's multicultural. And I feel that Toronto have a lot to teach. But when it comes to the music industry, Toronto would give you that start. But you have to look for the rest for yourself. You understand it's like you 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 have to meet toronto halfway so that toronto could meet you in the middle you know you have to work hard like i say you have to work hard to get you what you want and if you don't put yourself out there toronto won't recognize you toronto won't see you yeah. toronto won't hear you and well yeah i mean as a, i'm a musician too right uh and and it's one of the things that in toronto there's so much music there's so much entertainment that it's almost like to get recognized you almost have to go outside of the 416 out into the suburbs or out even across the province or across the country it is true it because is in true. toronto it's like there's just so much talent so much entertainment that's going on that it's almost like how do you really stand out in that situation? You definitely have to spread out. You 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 have to spread out because if if it's overloaded with entertainment, you got to find a different channel yeah. that you could sell your your talent, sell whatsoever that you into, because everybody wants to do the same thing in that little bubble. So you have to depart from that bubble to go steal. Mm -hmm. and the hard shipment again to get that next bubble out there that have less entertainment that could uh, say, okay, you could get something that you don't have to wait too long to get. Mm -hmm. You understand? But when it comes to Toronto, Toronto is like a seasonal 
entertainment kind of uh, country. And the reason why I say it's seasonal because it's every summer entertainers oh, yeah. really get to do what they got to do. They relied on the stage show, concert, local activity that happening in the community or in the province. And then uh, in that situation there now, you'll find that if I'm not your friend, you won't hire me because you don't know what I could do. Right. It's just yeah. the, the, the thing is that you, you, you have to know that you have to give an artist one chance to know what they can and what they cannot do. Mm -hmm. And if that artist cannot bring it the way you want them to bring it, then you say, well, okay, next year we'll have to look into a different artist mm -hmm. because I want my, my organization to have a certain platform that bring good mm -hmm. entertainment. Mm -hmm. you, All right. So I know I'm asking all the questions here, Deva, <laughs> because <laughs> because you already because know. You give me a chance. You already know Chris Fire. I, I, this is he the first time I met him. I know. He, right? He's he, he just taking over the whole <laughs> thing. Like I can't even say nothing. <laughs> but it's all right, um, Chris, because I, I know question. him. Okay, okay, okay. We'll get, we'll give him one more question, and then, and then I can ask, ask. And then we're gonna hear. Uh, I appreciate. Chris actually I appreciate. I appreciate. This. But uh, I'm just curious, like. Uh, when did you discover first of all what is you're singing i know that but you're doing the the fire i i don't even know what that's all about but when you were like can you tell us a story when you were growing up how you realized that you had this talent and and you realized that you wanted to do this as an art form and as a vocation thanks for asking because uh back in the days uh in my youth days there was nothing really happening within the community and if you could play drums, you play drums. If you could dance, you dance. If you could sing, you sing. And then I, I chose dancing because the economy, when it comes for work, there is no work. And, and then uh, I look into tourism. Mm -hmm. And then tourism was the gateway for entertainment on the island. Mm -hmm. So go to the hotels. You, I perform with all hotels that's on the island of St. Lucia. I thought I was living in a hotel. Mm -hmm. You know, by the time you oh. perform with 10 different hotels on the island, you could automatically say that you're living in the hotel. Yeah. Because that was my life. That's that I, I, I became a dancer because it's true. There was nothing else to do. And all I had to do to make that ends meet and to take care of me as a St. Lucian in St. Lucia, I had to be an entertainer mm -hmm. and become an entertainer at the resort. I think to myself, well, that's when I thought about different channels that I could surf, places that I could go to and do shows and work with different people. And Dancing been in the family for as long as I know myself living. I when I when I when I raised uh, with my grandmother and my grandmother used to be a folk dancer, folk singer. My father used to be a, a calypsonian and a drummer, and all the time they were doing all these things. I never really put me into it because at the age of 10 growing up that's what my folks do you know every weekend you have a group of people come into the house and play drums people dancing around so i watch the style of dancing that they do and i put it into work and i go like i want to be like my parents mm -hmm. i want to do the same thing that my parents did so did they breathe fire as well? <laughs> I have family members who do fire eating and okay. breathe fire and limbo dancing also. And getting into the fire eating segment, yeah. it was some friend who came from Barbados. He is St. Lucia, <laughs> but living in Barbados by the name of IG. And he had these two ladies with him, Aini and Ainita, which they visit the island. And knowing that he my father best friend because when my father was in Barbados, 
he's the one who look after my father because my father has a, a guest in the yeah. country. So he looked after my father and then he came down and visit my father with his two ladies. And he goes like, this is what he do. He do limbo dancing, fire eating and bottle dancing. That's when these arts come in, but I was already a dancer. So all I was missing to put everything together, it was this arts these elements that he bring down and introduce it to me. And I go like, okay, that sound interested. But I watch him do it. I take like about three or four lessons with him. My stepsisters, Anna, Leah, Elma, they were the one who performed with him. And I was just in the back watching what he doing because i was kind of a little younger and maybe doing my own thing and don't really care it's how you're eating it's like this but when i really sit again and think about it i say i want to do that and then i start practicing doing fire eating and doing broken bottle dancing and limbo dancing and that's how i become wow getting the talent well that's kudos to you i tell you because i wouldn't just sit home i guess we're coming from a different element of life and a different way of thinking and you know when you're when you're doing this stuff and the elements and all the different things that this it's a lot of hard work it and, is. and then you know and you're coming up with all these new songs the money money you got a new one called money right yes so tell us briefly about that before you gotta come on because well, we gotta show you money i sat home during covid and i'm thinking like what caused people to do what they do you know because they have useless killing useless hacking useless robbing and useless noise What's the cause? And everybody losing their life over a dollar or two dollars, 25 cents, a loony. You never know the person you robbed today, mm -hmm. what he have in his pocket. Yeah. Sometimes he have nothing in his pocket. You might just get his shoes. Mm -hmm. So that's when it come to me and say, that's what people want. They want money. They want to get a car and they love following brand mm -hmm. these are the three things that the youth and them interested into money kia and brand sounds like there's more important things <laughs> in life though that people really should be interested in but this is where our culture is going right and that's where i feel to myself that there's a song there <laughs> ah so that's what that's yes. what the song's about, about. yes and, and that's gonna be we're gonna do that now yes. we're I don't want to rush this here because now we gotta come we're back. finally <laughs> getting into the real meat and potatoes yes. Of, yes. Uh -huh. of 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 what you're thinking and feeling about about stuff that informs that you your put art, right? into your art. So by putting these thoughts into your art, you create uh, a vortex, you know, like a volcano. And you're ready to explode, let the world know well, what is it that our people want? And our people is the youth. Yeah. You understand? Because yeah. we have our nine to five. Mm -hmm. The youth and them, they know that the parents are the one giving them what they have. Mm -hmm. And the things that they ask the parents, it costs money. Mm -hmm. And some of our parents cannot afford to give the youth and them, whatever they're looking for, but they don't have the patience to understand that we could live with what we have today. Well, or, uh, yes, of course, that's one thing, and to be grateful for what you have, no matter what it is, right? Yes. But also, if you want to realize that if you want the money, if you want the car, you got to work for it. You got, you got to... You know, you got to plan it. You got to work it, and you can't just expect that you can just. I just need the money. It doesn't come by itself. Right? Yes, yes. They should understand that. I try to make them understand that. That's why money come with gone. Yeah. You want money, 
and you don't want to work for it, gun involved. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Bad company involved. Useless crimes involved because you want that money. Mm -hmm. So, in other words, that as much as this song based on money, mm -hmm. it's still telling you that put down your gun mm -hmm. and show me your love finger. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. Because by holding that gun, you will use that gun as your strength to go and do everything that you possibly could do to get that money. Mm -hmm. Because that's, that's a gateway for you to go about doing negativity. And it's not good. See, I wish we could... Uh... Yes. We got to have uh, Chris back, come back again because we already got the musical and Money is the last song he did. I don't want to miss that here today. We got a, just a couple minutes left here. Right. Just tell people where we can find you. Well, you could find me. And you can book him. Chris <laughs> Fire 10 ENT at gmail.com or you could telephone me 647 573 9558. This is your love finger. This is your gun finger. Put your gun finger down. Put your love finger up. World, we love nice. you. Okay, awesome. That's great. well. Chris, we I'm love you, and we we want you to come back. And also, we want to do want to thank people to you know to tune in today for Caribbean Liquid Lunch, and we're gonna send out this this video today with Chris Fire Ten Entertainment. If you like him, just give us a shout back and or give him a shout back. Yep, and I just want to say thanks to everybody for tuning in on our first show. I know we, you know, we're figuring out how to do this, but we want to hear from you as well. If you want to be on the show, you got something to share with the audience. Uh, give us an email, Caribbean Liquid Lunch at gmail.com. Yes. Right. Okay, okay. So we're gonna go for Chris. Yes. Thanks everybody, Thank you, everybody. for tuning in. Bye. Here's the show. Peace. One of these Peace. moments, it's gonna happen, <laughs> like right about now. Life. It is the Caribbean liquid lunch. Alongside the boss. Yo, real life matter. Give a shout out to all the people that viewing right now. Give a shout out to St. Lucian people, Grenadian people, Jamaican people, Africa people. There's a tune for each and every one of you. I'm trusting that world is coming true. This one called Who Feels It Knows It. During COVID, I try to work it out and see how things are run. But let me tell you, feel your pain. I know what you're going through now. You! What do you want me to do to run down? Uh, why, yeah. What do you want me to say, Canada? Boy, boy, yeah. Watch it. Time. In a tea dot, me could a think it so nice. So me, little job. See here some money, so me send for me son and daughter. Oh, oh yeah. Baby mother, them couldn't do any better. Oh, yeah. Baby mother, them couldn't do any better Ooh, oh, yeah. and this is them same enough it to be a father uh, that make me mad so them turn around and them take away my bikini from me Ooh, oh, yeah. them give him new mommy new puppy New brother and a new sister. New mommy, new puppy. New brother and a new sister. Come down, could the people let me know you're thinking about? Oh, yeah. First time when me step in a tea dot. Me could a think it's so nice, so me find a little job. See some money, so me send son and that. What? 
baby mother, them couldn't do any better. Oh, yeah, yeah. And this is them same enough it to be a father. Ah, that make me mad. So them turn around and them take away my bikini from me. Oh, yeah. Them give him new mommy. New. New. What? Them give him new mommy. New puppy. New. World. Big up. Fire 10. Now. We want to take this one to another level. I see, I'm telling you. <laughs> I want to talk to the ghetto youth them now. Whether you have a gun, put it down. The way you bury your gun. The way you seize it up now. How I say people them out the road. The way you be careful Beats with the life you live in. Save yourself. Get to you, come tell me the matter. Every time we step out, you up here, disaster. Minister say we lose with temper. Mama work hard to make things better. Not even one quarter, not even one dollar. Every time we turn we back, come and get murder. Them kind of thing, no good for we area. Follow me, follow me. Life in the ghetto, it is my paradise. Beg all the youth man, them to unite. Put down the grudge on the force and fight. Let's get together, Auntie G, youth right. When me was a youth in the community, me mom and daddy used to take care of me and if not, by me whole family, family, Beats family, family. family. So me tell them, get to you, come tell me the matter. So me say, get to you, come tell me the matter. Yow, yow, get to you, come tell me the matter. Ah, ah, ah. Get to you, come. Now hear this, Satra, hear this. Ha. Cry, cry, cry. African cry, cry, cry. African cry, cry, cry. Wipe the chase down in an African eye. Cry, cry, cry. African cry, cry, cry. African cry. Chase down an African eye. Them don't have no food, them don't have no water, them don't have no shelter. The children are suffer. Come go down, people, me say, let's get together. Be Africa from the drought, yeah. Send for the doctors and the nurses. Send for the doctors and the nurses. Beats by SP.com. Cry. Cry, cry, cry. African cry. Chase on an African eye. Cry. Cry, cry, cry. African cry. Hear this? Chase on an African Don't tell me about the thing that I want so. Go to people, let me tell you how it went go. In the place where we live in a sorrow gun. Don't tell me about the thing and where you gone so. You see the style where them have to and put so. Through the sorrow it just have begun. So me tell them cry. Cry, cry, cry. African cry. Chase on an African eye. Cry. Cry, cry, cry. African cry. <laughs> Chase on an African eye. Don't you forget Africa where you come from. Looking at your heart, Africa is your motherland. Don't you forget about your forefather. Don't you forget about your foremother. Don't you forget African culture. Africa we there, Africa you there. Cry. Cry, cry, cry. African cry. Chase on an African eye. Cry. Cry, cry, cry. African cry. <laughs> Chase on an African eye. Do you see? The brother that we can have them and we can them say them and one say. Could have evil. Live. World. Big up yourself. You love money. You love care. Ha, you love brand. Yo, my youth. Let me tell you. Could have evil. You are one. Money them I look for. Yeah, them a look for brand them a pala. Come get to you, me say time to make a dollar. You here? See you on the corner with you. No few tapas, them a call you gangster. Policeman come, them no free to fire. No shot a boss, me say they on the corner. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Yo, 
Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Some of you say, money them I look for. Car them I look for. Run them a pala. Come get to youth, me say time to make a dollar. You hear? See you on the corner with your finger upon trigger. No future pass, them I call you gangster. Policeman come, they no free to fire. No short a boss, me say they on the corner. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Love finger that. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Lucian. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Yeah, me tell him, let me tell him. Ha! In the ghetto, have too much friend enemy, yo. Friend, friend, friend enemy, yo. In the ghetto, have too much friend enemy, yo. Friend, friend, friend enemy. Everybody walk on, make some money, you know. Make, make, make some money. Everybody walk on, make some money, uh -huh. Make, make, make some money. Money, they may look for. Car, they may look for. Run them a pala, come get to youth, me say time to make a dollar. You hear? See you on the corner with your finger upon trigger. No future pass, them a call you gangster. Policeman come, them no free to fire. No shot a boss, me say they on the corner. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Me no know why you say them brother Trevor. Do you know him as a baby father? Him come abroad, try to make things better. Why should we kill him over one dollar? Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Global, hear this. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Yeah. Put down your gun, show me your love finger. Oh yeah, them say, wicked man. Money them a look for. Car them a look for. Brand them a fella. Get together. Keep up on the weather, don't lose your culture, go the people, for your turn I tell you sir, Caribbean, liquid land, we do it live, you know, to the people out there I would like you to know, to make it in this time, you gotta work hard at it, you gotta wanna be it, you wanna be that person, you gotta wanna do the things that you wanna do. Be conscious as the thing that you want to do. Be conscious with the life that you live in. That's why I call this tune, Money Them I Look For. One love to the people in them who watch and listen. And who log in to Caribbean Liquid Land. Peace. Yeah, viewers, that was it. That was Fire 10 telling you that. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for partying with me. So big respect to you. We out. We out.